In 1999, NASA's Mars Climate Orbiter burned up just as it was ready to enter the Mars atmosphere. What caused the orbiter to fail in its mission? A failure to convert units from English to metric. To help prevent unit mismatch issues such as this one, we introduced Simulink units in R2016A. This tool gives you the power of unit visualization, consistency checking, and conversion. Let's use the fuel control system model as an example. Units can be specified on input ports and output ports. Here we specify units on three input ports and the units propagate and display on the signal lines. If you specify kilograms per second at the fuel rate controller's output port, Simulink will automatically convert to grams per second at the engine gas dynamics input and report a warning. You can quickly fix the warning by adding a unit conversion block, which converts kilograms per second to grams per second. Simulink also does unit consistency checking. If you mistakenly specify this output port to be kilograms instead of kilograms per second, Simulink reports a unit mismatch at the connecting port. To see the full list of units supported by Simulink, use the Show Units List MATLAB command. This displays the full list of built-in units and their definitions. You may have noticed that kilograms per second is not on this list. That's because Simulink supports expressions of units formed from the units in this list and SI unit prefixes. Similarly, you can construct other unit expressions, such as kilometers per hour, meters per second, or newton meters. If you would like to limit the list of units to a particular unit system, such as SI, Simulink supports unit system checking. In this example, we've set the subsystem to only allow SI units. As degree is not defined in SI, Simulink will report a warning for that unit. The Simulink Units feature also allows you to specify units in data objects outside a model. For example, you can specify units for Simulink.Signal objects. In summary, you can specify units on input and output ports, signal objects, bus elements, parameter objects, and state flow data ports. Simulink supports unit visualization, consistency checking, conversion, and unit system checking to better model real world interfaces. Thanks for watching. To learn more about units in Simulink or to download a trial to try some examples for yourself, check out the links below.